Okay, so here's here's the uh, almond milk that we had. Started, and uh, here's where I put in the probiotic. It, it looks a little yogurt-y, and I'll give it a taste. Ooh, oh my gosh. So sweet. This is unbelievable. So it's not completely uh, settled. It is so sweet. It's not some of the bitter or bland tasting that we have. I guess if I left that a little longer, it would continue to... Uh, ferment. So these are more almond ones. I've left them. Definitely fermenting. Unbelievably sweet and delicious. I have to, I can't recall if I put in uh, sugar in this or not. But it's clear it needs some more time. It's not, uh, it's not very yogurty firm. But it's delicious. I can report that. So here are the soybean uh, samples I made, soybean milk samples. This is definitely yogurt y. Can you see it? This had a prune in it. Definitely tangy. Definitely tangy, like yogurt. I think I should add salt. Uh, depending, um, it, maybe it should have either more prunes or see how it stands on its own. But definitely yogurt, yogurt-like. So the soy needs uh, a little salt and maybe some sugar to sweeten it if you want sweet but otherwise I would say that this is definitely a yogurt I would say it's definitely curd this is more curd like uh, which is what South Indians eat wow definitely curd like look at that so we have successfully made curd. You would just need to play around with it to see what, how sweet you want it. This is not sweet. It's tangy. It needs some salt. And uh, if you're using it as curd, I think it's fine now. But if you're going to eat it like yogurt, I think you would want to um, put some sugar in it. So, uh, go back over the recipe, but here we definitely have uh, yogurt. And what you need to know is, again, there were no blankets, there were no incubators, nothing was sterilized, this was made warm, if we recap, and then let uh, get less warm. So, when we put in the probiotics, um, there was no heat, no thermometers, just a little warm. Wow. 
So I think that's it. Oh, God. Definitely tangy. Uh, but I think for the average uh, yogurt consumer, you need oh, to dull it up some oh, way more. to be um, sweet tasting, not just sour, pungent. But anyway, this has been a success. Here are all four bottles. We're done. And I, I wouldn't say the almond is a success yet. This almond is definitely delicious. But so there you go. So we have soy yogurt. Ta-da! Thank you. And I'll just recap the time. This was in the dead of winter. And we didn't, there we go, so it's February 27th, just 22nd, just a little bit before 6 p.m. in the dead of winter uh, with the house quite cold. And so it worked. Goodbye.